Liar, Pants on Fire by Miriam Cohen, illustrated by Ronald Himmler. Danny told Jim what he wanted for Christmas. It's a racer car with rocket shooters in the back, and it goes 1,000 miles an hour. How can it go that fast? Jim asked. Boosters, Danny said. The new boy Alex heard them. I've already got one of those, but mine is a triple rocket model and it goes 2,000 miles an hour. Has it got trick action? Danny wanted to know. Of course, Alex said. Let's build a fort, Jim, Danny said. At lunch, Sarah was telling about her new hamster. I'm going to call her Chinooka because that's when I got her. I have a pony, Alex said. Is it a real pony? George wanted to know. Can I see it? Sometime, but not today. He's sick, said Alex. He hasn't got any pony, said Danny. How do you know? asked Jim. Sarah said, Alex couldn't have a pony. He lives in an apartment. Alex is a liar, said Anna Maria. Don't play with him. Alex went to put his lunch bag in the trash. Paul said, I don't like Alex. He keeps saying that he has something better than everybody else. And when Alex came back, Danny yelled, Liar, liar, pants on fire. Everyone but Jim shouted it too. So teacher talked to them. She said, Maybe Alex isn't really lying. Maybe he's just trying to get you to notice him. Try to be friends with Alex. Remember, it isn't easy to be new. First grade was so busy getting ready for their holiday party, they didn't have time to be Alex's friend. Most of them didn't want to anyway. First grade was going to have a tree that they decorate themselves. Their teacher told them they should make decorations from things that would be thrown away, such as plastic bottles, egg cartons, cotton, and paper towel tubes. Jim worked very hard on a bleach bottle Santa Claus. His mother gave him a red sock for a cap because the other sack had been lost in the laundry. He used cotton for the beard and he drew the nicest, kindest face. When he put the marker down, he couldn't believe he had made such a good Santa. The morning of the holiday party, everybody hurried to school carrying their decorations. Louise was a folded paper bird with wings that could move. Margaret had a picture of her baby brother pasted in a little cardboard box bed. It had a tiny cotton blanket. Willie and Sammy made a train with Santa riding in one of the cars. His taking the Uptown Express to our houses, they said. Jim Santa's cap was missing. When he went to look for it, Alex found it. Here, he said. It was outside. Oh boy, thanks, said Jim. Everybody was laughing and running around. The teacher said, line up please, we'll take turns putting our decoration on the tree. Alex, did you make anything? Alex looked at the floor. I don't know how, he said. Suddenly, Jim felt sorry for Alex. He got out of the line and put his bleach-bottled Santa in Alex's hand. Here, you can put it on the tree, he said. Anna Maria said very loudly, You're just wasting your nice Santa Claus on that boy. But the teacher smiled at Jim. At the party, Alex was the fastest relay runner. He won for Anna Maria's team. George said, Alex can run faster than any pony. After the party, Alex said to Jim, I don't really have a pony. That's all right, said Jim. You're the best runner in the first grade. Anna Maria was listening. And that's the truth, she said.